15 жовтня я вже знала, що більше не буду пити. Останні 18 років алкоголь був постійним супутником у моєму житті. Але цього разу, завершуючи свій 41-й марафон, я святкуватиму по-новому. Перше, без алкоголь. Цього разу алкоголь не буде частиною мого постмарафонського свята. Going sober is not something you just do. It takes a lot of thought processing and it's very challenging since the alcohol is everywhere from airports to stadiums and it's very difficult to avoid. Living a sober life means that I need to plan a lot of things beforehand. I need to constantly remind myself that alcohol is not a part of my life anymore. Коли я працювала журналістом в Україні, алкоголь був частиною повсякденного життя. На світських вечірках, або під час прес-поїздок, або просто коли я поверталась додому, то я відчувала, що заслуговую на те, щоб прослабитись, відпочити і випити. The first red flag came, then the COVID hit. We were forced to stay at home, and all the social activities and travels stopped. But I didn't stop drinking, even though I was at home alone almost all of the time. Every morning I woke up with hangovers uh, and said to myself I have to quit and every evening I started doing all over again. However, social support has been a key factor for me in going sober. Just my decision to tell a friend about my addiction, then publicly coming out helped me a lot. Surprisingly, uh, I've met lots of support and people were really impressed of my choice. You think your life will change drastically and you become sober. But it wasn't true in my case. For example, I didn't lose weight, I didn't become rich, and uh, honestly, all of my problems stayed around. But it's the small things that change and they add up. I feel the biggest change in my mental health and confidence. My mood and my self-esteem have gotten a boost and I sleep better. My mother, of course, keeps saying that I look differently, more fresh and glowy, and uh, I see changes, of course, every day more and more often. Alcohol is a very часто способ приховати свої страхи. Я боялась реальності, і я боялась життя. Але я вирішила, що страх не має жодного сенсу. Можу сказати, що найкраще у тверезості це жити справжнім життям.